Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Ironworker Gaming Channel. It is May 8th of 2020 and Zur is back. So let's go see what this Jive Turkey brought this week. This week, once again, Zur can be found on Nessus. So load yourself into the Watcher's Grave, then follow me on screen to the top deck of the giant golden ship. Make sure when you jump up here, you jump onto the ramp and not under the ramp. Under the ramp's just not going to work out. Once you are on the main deck of the barge, hang a right and head all the way to the back of the ship. And hey, there's Zer. This week for the exotic weapon, Zer has brought hard light. Poor, poor hard light. It had its time in the sun. Kind of got hit by a nerf here, I haven't tried it out since, but from what I hear, it's not great. But if you'd like to pick it up and try it out, and then let me know what you think, that would be awesome. For our hunter buddies, Zer has brought the Gwizen Vest, fantastic exotic for your Spectral Blade subclass. You get a kill before you go stealth, and you will get some of your super energy back, especially useful in the Crucible. For the Titan, Zer has brought Hollow Fire Heart. Solar abilities regenerate faster, and even faster when your super is charged. For the Warlock, Zer has Apotheos Veil. Immediately regenerate health, melee, grenade, and rift energy upon activating your super, plus nearby enemies' class abilities recharge faster. Not a fantastic exotic, pretty niche, but worth picking up I suppose if you don't have it. As always, the Exotic Ingram is for sale for 97 Legendary Shards if you are looking for an Exotic from a previous season that you have just not been able to acquire. And that's it for Xur this week. Please remember to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. Please remember to subscribe if you would like to support this channel. And that is going to do it. You guys are awesome. I will catch you on the next one.